things out now, shall we? Shoo, 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 na, shoo, go, so, rock, shoo, go, go, shoo, go, die, so, the same, yeah. I die my particles to die in a trap, and how the world I'll make my everyone, welcome to my full moon concert. I've decided to do something a little different this full moon and as it's getting warmer here in Vancouver I was able to catch the sunset at the beach uh, this evening so I hope you enjoyed the sunset it was really beautiful. Uh, now it's it's evening and I thought uh, now that I'm back and it's a little cozy that I would read something for you as well. And um, I just want to let you know that I am postponing the photo shoot for the album cover until probably late June, early July, just because of a lot of uh, scheduling um, scheduling issues. So uh, it's coming, but it's just a little bit delayed. So thank you for your patience. I'm so excited to show you everything that we've been up to. And actually, the extra time has given me a little bit more time to to think things through and to process a little bit more and to really make sure that I'm doing um, the right album cover uh, for this particular for this particular album and for the the storyline and the and the song so so it's actually been a really great time please enjoy the few songs and thank you so much for watching Water is one I can cross it, and neither have the wings to fly. Build me a boat that can carry two and fall down. Thank you. 
Happy labors done, seek their close nests and bide. Screamed in the leafy wood, the stock doves sit and brood. The very squirrel leaps from bough to bough, but lays no pauses and settles now, where once he stored his food. One by one the flowers close, lily and dewy rose, shutting their tender petals from the moon. The grasshoppers are still, but not so soon, are still the noisy crows. The dormouse squats and eats choice little dainty bits beneath the spreading roots of a broad line. Nibbling his fill, he stops from time to time and listens where he sits. Far from the rains come of cattle driven home. From farther still, the wind brings fitfully the vast continual murmur of the sea. Now loud, now almost dumb. The gnats whirling the air, the evening gnats. And there the owl opes broad his eyes and wings to sing. For prey, the bat wakes and the shellless snail comes forth, clammy and pale. Hark, that's the nightingale, telling the selfsame tale. Her song told when this ancient earth was young. So echoes Elsa when her song was sung on the first little thing. We call it love and pain, the passion of her strain. And yet we little understand or know. Why should it not be rather joy that so throbs in each throbbing grave? In separate herds the deer lie, hear the bucks, and hear the doves, and by its mother sleeps the fawn. Through all the hours of the night until the dawn they sleep, forgetting. The hare sleeps where it lies, with wary half-closed eyes. The cock has ceased to crow, the hen to cluck. Only the fox is out, some heedless duck or chicken to surprise. The moat each single star comes out, till there they are, all shining brightly. 
how the dews fall down, while close at hand the glowworm lights her lamp or twinkles from afar. But evening now is done. Thank you so much for joining me this evening. Um, I've created a little tea of mint leaves and raspberry leaves from the garden. And um, I always like to offer the moon a little something at night and then drink the water in the morning. So I've prepared to, not just with this tea, but with another bowl, I've put some, some herbs in there and I'll leave it overnight. And the moon will shine down. It's really beautiful and bright tonight. Um, so I always like to do that every full moon, so that's kind of a fun ritual to um, celebrate the expression of love and peace. So I hope you all have a really beautiful evening. Thank you so much for joining me, and I will see you next full moon. <laughs>